Our top story tonight, meth addiction among teens is growing at an alarming rate. Youth Town says in just the last nine months, the number of teens they've seen addicted has grown by 20%. WBBJ 7 Eyewitness News reporter Heather Mathis joins us now, who talked to a 16-year-old who's a recovering addict. She joins us now live with that story. Heather? Mark Bradley is a normal 16-year-old. He loves his friends, sports. He even played for his high school football team. But he says he slowly lost months of his life, addicted to meth. Mark Bradley has been clean of meth for more than 100 days, but he spent six months addicted to the drug. Bradley remembers using for weeks straight. Once you catch your first high for the day, you can't catch it anymore. No more. You just want to chase it and chase it. And next thing you know, you've been up for two weeks almost. And Bradley is in recovery at Youth Town. Lead medical director Dr. Neil Bomar says meth is gaining popularity with teens. In the past, it was really unheard of to see a young person, 14 or 15, that's used methamphetamine. Now they say 10% of kids at Youth Town are addicted to the drug. It seems like in the last six to nine months, we're seeing more and more uh, young people, especially young males, that use methamphetamine. Probably about at least 25% of the kids are, and most of them was ninth and 10th graders. Dr. Bomar says one of the first signs a teen is using is bad performance in school. Well, grades suffer. Uh, this young man that I saw today is generally an A and B student. Now he's flunking out. Not doing my schoolwork at all. I'd go to school high. A scary fact, many teens learn to make and use meth in their own home. When a young man is using it, many times his parents will use it or a family member uses it. Bradley says he's playing football again and wishes that teens who use meth get the chance to feel as good as he does sober. Showing my kids out a little bit while I'm here. I feel, I feel happy though, I feel way better. For parent tips on how to spot teen meth abuse, go to WBBJTV.com and click the Scene on 7 link. Heather Mathis, WBBJ 7 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Heather.